What is that? Ah, it's just your friendly neighborhood cosplaying Incredible Squirrel. He really wants to join our team. <sighs> Not with a baby around, Helen. These squirrels can be very dangerous. I'll take care of it. Hey, squirrel, I'm going to have to ask you to leave, okay? Okay, hey! Ah! Hey, stop it! Ah! Stop it! Ah! Uh! Uh, do you think we should help him? Now, Violet, your father has been a superhero for a long time. I'm sure he can handle the squirrel. Ah! Whew! That squirrel was nuts! Hey, kids, how would you all like to go out for ice cream sundaes? With nuts in them, of course, nuts. <laughs> nuts, yes. Woohoo, I'm coming! I do like ice cream. Fine. On the table, Disney Pixar Incredibles 2 Lego Junior's construction sets. We have The Great Home Escape, Elastigirl's Rooftop Pursuit, and Underminer Bank Heist. Three exciting sets, all easy to build. Let's begin where the last movie left off. Set number 10760, Underminer Bank Heist, 149 pieces. On the back of the box, stuff included with this set. Looks like we have the minifigures of Mr. Incredible, Elastigirl, and Underminer, plus easy to build vehicles. Inside the box, one booklet of incredible instructions, bag of pieces one, bag two, and three. That must be a car, and a vehicle, and a base plate. Let's dash this Underminer bank heist out. Okay, constructed Underminer Bank Heist, and there's a lot of stuff going on with this bank heist. We have Underminer in this awesome two-bore vehicle, two spinning bore things. What do you call these? Drills, that's the better word on these things. And I like how it's a back and forth vehicle. It's always something that's just forward, and finally we've got something to just kind of tunnel along. Oh dear, oh dear, what has he done? Good minifigure though, short in stature, pig-like, kind of hard to see. I like how LEGO Juniors just does the one whole cape too, by the way. Why haven't they done that more often? So much easier. In fact, building this entire set was so much easier, I wonder why. It kind of harkens back to the 90s when LEGO sets weren't so complicated. Of course we have Mr. Incredible here included with the set, and we've seen him before with one of the lines of the minifigures, Disney themed. It does not look like they've changed much. In fact, he looks almost the same, maybe a little more face smirk and brow furling from the Disney minifigures version. It does seem the location of the belt moved from the pants to the torso. And not really the best capture of Mr. Incredible 2, he's too small. I know you can't really place him on a Hulk body, that would be too much. If they could figure out something like Axel from Nexo Knights, maybe that would have worked better. Too small, but the hair looks good. Good hair piece. Then we have Elastigirl over in this car. Again, a nice easy build. Most of the frame already constructed for you. This Elastigirl grumpy and friendly version. However, this isn't the best Elastigirl minifigure there is. When we get to the rooftop pursuit, that's the figure we want to see with the bendy arms. Also included, of course, is a Bank 2 heist, and we should be able to take Underminer's drill here and smash through. Well, that worked pretty well. 
And inside the bank we have all sorts of things to collect. It looks like golden crystals, a bag full of something, and more importantly, the safe. This thing is loaded with all sorts of stuff. We have a blue diamond on top, and it looks like several big bills and even more gold blocks going on. So a really good score for Underminer. Also included in this set we have this little wanted poster, fire hydrant to hit, trash can full of stuff. And a lamppost too. Can't forget the lamppost. Lamppost! Overall a fun little set. Okay, let's move on. Let's move on to LEGO Jr's Incredibles 2, set number 10759, Elastigirl's Rooftop Pursuit, 95 pieces. And yes, here's a set where the supers actually look super. Look at those crazy arms. On the back of the box, we have many things that make this construction set look fun, including the easy to build helicopter. Inside the box, another set of incredible instructions. Package of pieces one, package of pieces two, Elastigirl's arms. Face plates, helicopter shoes, and a helicopter torso. Let's pursue the rooftop Elastigirl. have Elastigirl's Rooftop Pursuit. Now this set feels a little more super with those arms. That is some ultra silliness on a minifigure. She seems to like waving them around. Oh hey, that's a cool trick. Wait a second. How is she doing that? Incredible. So apart from an amazing minifigure of Elastigirl, we also have a helicopter on a landing pad up on the roof or on a table, and we can take the helicopter off the landing pad and fly it around. A real nice little simple helicopter, again very reminiscent of older sets of the day. I like the helicopter too because we have a little opening hatchback here that you can store stuff in. That worked out pretty well. Also a little spiral on top, and a pilot who looks to be up to no good. Then over here on the rooftop part, kind of neat, there's a lot of little pieces to it. We have a helicopter landing pad, a little air conditioner unit, some communication equipment over here, and there is a billboard up on top, 18% approval rating for Elastigirl, I suppose. And we have a little laptop computer as well, and a little tracker, as there is a little tracker on the back of the helicopter. I kind of wish there was one more incredible with this set, but that's okay. Elastigirl's arms make up for it. Oh yeah, a little more on Elastigirl's bike. I should add, it's a little tricky to get her hands to hold on to the handlebars. Maybe if you make one arm longer than the other, you can get that going. There we go. Balance! Woo! -hoo. And finally today, the rest of the family with set number 10761, The Great Home Escape. 178 pieces, with invisible violet, dash on a skateboard, and of course, Jack-Jack. On the back of the box, much stuff included with this set for the Incredible Family. I'm going to say people are going to want this set mostly for Jack-Jack. Inside the box, the last Incredible Instruction Booklet. Bag one, two, three. Oh, there's windows. Nice foundation. Someone's car. And another plate. Let's escape the great home.
and welcome to the Great Home Escape. Lots of elements going on with this construction set, mainly the Incredibles kids. We have Dash on a skateboard. Violet and Jack-Jack in his little fireball. With this set, you can pretty much complete the whole family. So who's that over there in the car? Brickarella? Brickster? Madam Brickley? Brickington? I don't know. Pretty simple to build car though with a brick launcher on the back and plenty of bricks. Simply place in the back catapult and shoot away. I'm sure we'll know more about her soon. As for the core house, some things going on. It's mainly a living room area space with a orange couch and some back doors. And we've got a nice little family portrait. And it does slide over, revealing the incredible super secret something. Simple slide back and forth. Nothing too hard to build there for kids. We have the red Incredibles phone in case we need to uh, get an emergency message of sorts. And down here in this little drawer, looks like we have some sort of tracking device or some sort of electronic thing. Over on this side of the room is this kind of strange water slide thing. I'm not exactly sure what that is. Is that how you get into the incredible secret sanctuary? I don't know. But take your figure, and I guess we'll open this up. And you can slide him through with it closed. He just kind of sits there. Still trying to figure that out. Then we have a nice little chair for Violet to sit on. I'm not sure if we're supposed to flip her out or not. Oh, but there we go, plus a little juice box. And we have a nice little Incredibles waiting pool. I like it when they stick the little extra pieces in there to simulate water. Looks like we have a little water cannon too. I've seen it on the box like this. So kind of a fun little set of components. Again, it's mainly for the family pieces. You're gonna want this for Jack-Jack for sure. And of course, Violet. And of course, Dash. All right, kids, I'm here to st- ah! Wow, she fell like a brick. And there is most everything we saw today for LEGO Junior's Incredibles 2. Mostly small scale stuff, easy to build, but fun to play with. I think out of the three sets, my favorite was Elastigirl's Rooftop Pursuit, mainly because of that awesome Elastigirl figure. Thank you! Although the Great Home Escape is a great pack for the kids. I suppose if you'd like to skip Elastigirl's noodle arms, you can pick up Underminer's bank heist and then have the whole family that way, but then you wouldn't have Elastigirl's arms, and that's pretty much my favorite part about this. Looking back in the instruction booklet, I'm a little disappointed though. The image for the video game has Mr. Incredible in a much larger figure suit. I'm not really sure why that wasn't designed for this series. He looks so much better that way. Is that something coming down the line eventually, we hope, I hope? And outside of these three sets that I built today, not really sure what else is coming. If there's something really, really amazing coming out in the future, please let us know in the comments. For now, we just have to worry about that new brick villain redesigning the family house. Put a brick there, and then we'll put another brick there, and uh, we'll put a brick there, and uh, we'll put one there, and there. Disney Pixar Incredibles 2 LEGO Juniors arrive on store shelves April 2018. The sets range in price from $20, $25, and $30 from small to large. And with them, you have a lively assortment of figures from the new Incredibles 2 movie. If you're looking to expand on the family of Mr. Incredible from the previous LEGO minifigures Disney line, these sets give you a great opportunity to do that. They're easy and fun simple sets that can take away some of the headache of the larger, enormous, multi-piece sets. However, where's Frozone? We want Frozone. That's what I have to say about that. The Incredibles family squirrel can cross a road without getting smooshed. Thanks for watching Squirrel Stampede. Please, like, share, subscribe. Oh. Guys? Guys! I had a little trouble with the squirrel. Help me out. Let me inside, guys! Where did you go? Where is everybody?
Oh, 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 oh,